Crazy Mike, crazymikesapps.com, with an iPad app demo for Find Them All Looking for Animals by k Media. This application is in the education category, is iOS Universal, which means it works on the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad all for free. This is an interactive, multi-language, animal-look-and-find game featuring animals in their natural habitat, along with lots of fun extras like creating jigsaw puzzles, an option to print out your own activity booklet, and more. Here's the opening screen. You're going to get farm animals for free with the application, and you can have all the look-and-find fun that is in this game. I'm going to show you in one of the other animal packs that I've already unlocked. There's animals of Africa currently, as well as animals of Oceania, which can be purchased through in-app purchase. Animals of Asia is still to come, and you can actually get an alert there when it's available. We can tap on animals of Oceania, and you jump into the look and find fun. Now, look for the Tasmanian devil. Now you start off with one environment, and I've played this game several times, and each time you start off in a different environment. There's 24 animals in each area, so there's lots of replayability. You're too good. You get a bobblehead effect when you get the high-definition photo for the animal, and there's a cool little slide wheel on the upper right, and you can listen to how the animal's name is pronounced in different languages, like... In Spanish... El Diablo de Tasmania. In French, Le Diablo de Tasmanie. In German, Der Tasmanische Teufel. In French, in Spanish, Tasmanian, the ears of the Tasmanian devil turn red when it is angry. Looks a little angry to me. Now you'll see this. To unlock this comment, take a photo of this animal. So to take a photo, you can unlock the different information about the animal. I've unlocked one, but there's still one more to unlock. Oh, the frill-necked lizard. Now we're, we're just stuck. We're in this island well, section. After we find so many animals in this section, we'll go to a new Excellent. section. Hello. Now you can go to the bush. Now we go to the bush and we're looking oh, for... A koala. A koala. You're too good. Bobblehead effect. Very cool. Find the green turtle. Hey, where's the green turtle? Not in the bush, is he? Heavens no. He's got to be over by the water. So they use both environments to Excellent. keep you on your toes. Look for the kiwi. You're too good. Look for the dingo. So once you find Excellent. the now animals the in that ocean. area, again, you're going to go to another area. Find the manta ray. Well done, you found it. Where is the saltwater crocodile? Great! And again, they're not always the same the each dingo. time you play the game. Now, this is an animal that reminds me of a manatee, which we have in Florida. Well done, you found it! Where is the cassowary? And after you find all the animals, you're going to get a certain reward. Let's see if we can find the... Too good. Cassowary. Where is the cascas? And this is how you play this game mode. Hmm, I'm guessing it's back in the area back here. No. Well done. You in the tree, of course. Now, once you've you won the found all the animals, you get the camera, and all the animals reappear. And you can take actually tap on the camera. Touch here to take a photo. Touch there to take a photo. And you touch can here to put your camera away. And you can also zoom in and zoom slide out. Slide your finger to move the lens. That's right. So you can slide it around. Once you find an animal you want to take a picture, you can zoom in, zoom out, take a photo, and you'll learn a fact the about the animal. It has a helmet on its head that allows it to cut a passage through the forest. And that is how you learn and unlock the... This photo is now in your album. And it's a... Touch here to go back to the game. So you learn about the animal by taking photos of it. You learn both facts by taking two photos of it. And it goes into your album. So we're going to head out of here. And I'm going to go back to the main area. Now, here is my album. And I can tap on my album. And once I'm in there, I can see all the photos that I've taken. Now, you can see my camera's got some stars on it. Because if you play 
through the night and you complete the night section which is you have to find animals in the dark based on the sound and the help from the sun you'll get rewarded with the jigsaw function so we can tap on this the saltwater crocodile has to come up to the surface of the water to breathe so you get a fact and we could shake the device, shake the device make a jigsaw. and we make a jigsaw oh, puzzle yeah. out of it the harder or the more you shake, the more puzzle pieces you get. And you can put them in place where they go and put the puzzle together. And that is a neat little feature about this application. And so on. Make sure you put the puzzle, well, see how fast you can put the puzzle together, actually. And again, it can be up to 42 pieces Great. on the iPad and 20 pieces on the, the iPhone. You will have. And that's Try what they it. said. So we'll exit out of there. You can do Jigsaw. There's a further game called the Photo Quiz, which you can access at a certain point as well. Again, cards are you here. Found them all. Go to the last page to see your rewards. Wow. So on this, we can go back to the last page to see where our reward is. I found all the animals in Animals of Oceania. You can now print your own booklet. There you go. Ask a grown up to help you. And they tell you how to print your own booklet. They give you the instructions here before printing. Start by downloading the 4 megabyte file. So that's a very cool feature. You can have all of those animals, and they're all very nice images. You can tap Stand on away. them. And if you've unlocked all the facts inside the app, you can learn about them more. If not, you can download them and have those images in your own activity booklet. Again, again, enter back out of there. You have your cards of the animals in Oceana, as well as your album of the photos you've taken. Head over to the settings, and you can change the sounds or turn them off, as well as the animals and the sun itself. You also have different languages to set it to, German, French, or um, English and Spanish. Turn in-app purchases off here. Notifications for news can be set there, and some other information about KMB Media social sites here, as well as information about the app itself. Again, Farm Animals comes free. In-app purchase for Animals of Africa and Animals of Oceania. And look out for Animals of Asia in the future. Until next time, this has been Crazy Mike from Crazy Mike's Apps saying see ya.